Benching. Good afternoon, buenos dias. Chuximena Chuyut. Do you hear me? A little bit louder? Okay, Anna, a little bit louder for those in the back. Dobry den, Shinoni Horsi, we time of us took Nasuiz Yut. You will welcome to you to Suiz Yilka for the Roma Prima Pohachowska Ukrainian Dance Academy, which is proud to announce and present their Yoriteka and the Ruby Slippers. The kids worked very hard the last two weeks, so I asked those of you in the back who are not seated but are interested in seeing the program, please, please be respectful and do not talk. If you want to talk, the bar will be happy to serve you a drink and you can talk there, but the kids work very hard, we want to make sure we give them their utmost attention. The God shall be able to have written the Sabahato, Bishop of Vitre, the Lishet Shetut in Nashikimnati, and Bishop of Nishabode. If, God forbid, there's an incident where we have to evacuate, there's an emergency exit in the back over here, back on the back of the side over there, and the staircase the way you came in. At the end of the program, we'll have a general picture uh, taken, and we'll give you an opportunity to take pictures also. Okay, so, uh, telephones off, flash cameras off, kids around the, okay. Gita, be you got it, be troshki, Gita, chke, obaha, troshki, shet, uzado, just a little bit more back. Ah, perfectamente, that's Spanish. Okay, to do see the in the program with the pad?
Sláva Isusu Hristu! Bože, dobre, by praktikovali a sa ľubiu. Ja by chcel predstaviť pár ľudí, ktorí je známe. Ja by chcel predstaviť pár ľudí, ktorí sú tu v audience. First, the managing director of Suez Yoka, Mr. Stefan Marankavich. President of the National Foundation, the President of the UNF, Mr. Roman Hernyak. <laughs> the Pastor of Holy Trinity Ukrainian Catholic Church, the part of... Uh, the, uh, we'll edit that out later. Uh, part of the Church, a text doctor, Ivan Kashak. Father still scares me sometimes when I'm standing up here. I see him staring at me and saying, Bravo. Prišled do nas mi vidite naše hosti, perše otec Voldemir Rutko. And please give a nice Suizilto welcome for the Metropolitan Archbishop of the Ukrainian Catholic Arch Eparchy of Philadelphia, Boris Kujak. And I want to invite His Excellency to come up here and say a few words. Thank you for this welcome. I think you want to thank the wonderful young ladies for that, that beautiful welcome that we all received. Welcome to you. Мені приємно признатися, що кожного разу, як я приїжджаю на свою зівку, щось тут, знаєте, в серці так тьохка є. Я не знаю, скільки разів я тут був на вакаціях з батьками, скільки разів я колись танцював тут чи там, знаєте, коли темпу грало. І бачите, нічого з того він не вийшло, ніхто мене не хотів. It's great to be at Suzuka, and it's wonderful to be at a dance recital because dance is a very evocative and very expressive means of communicating. It's so holistic, it's so integrated. The body, the eyes, the face, the limbs, but under that there's the rhythms, the music, the heart and the soul. It is really an expression of communion. At a Christian wedding, the first dance in our right happens actually in church, when the couple is led around the Tetrapod. Зараз ми переживаємо час великого виклику, як глобальна українська громада. І ті руки і ноги відривають, бомби, гранати і міни. Для мене особисто те, що тут відбувається цей табір, що з'їжджається тут молодь, батьки, знайомі, це є велике свідчення нашої стійкості. This dance shows in our community and through our community to a broader world at a time when Putin's Russia is trying to stamp out everything Ukrainian. We resist with body and soul. Our country... Our culture, our people are wounded, but we're unbroken. And we're going to dance our way to the victory of God's truth. I want to thank you for this school. I want to thank you for all of them who are leading to the school, the leaders of this school, who from decades and decades continue this tradition. всім учасникам, всім батькам. Те, що ви робите разом, 
має широкі і далекі значення. І нехай краса і радість цього концерту скріплює нашу настанову і нашу віру, нашу певність, що Божа правда переможе і що Україна ціла затанцює гопаком, завершуючи цю криваву війну. Нехай вас Господь благословить. Слава Ісусу Христу! Thank you, Your Grace. And with that, let's continue our program. Продовжуємо нашу програму. Тепер перший тенес називається «Гуцл Хореографі» by Діана Шмераковська.
have been written long before and have been used every year. All the dances you see are brand new, brand new choreographed, and the kids learned them in less than two weeks. Give them a great round of applause. <laughs> the next dance is called the Malenki Kozinchok Choreography, Diana Shmerkoska.
choreographer by this of a guy. Uh, There's 78 participants in this audience. Along with the counselors, there's 115. Stop it, night to see. Of them, 25 are second generation dancers, meaning their parents danced in the dance group. 25 of them are second generation. And 22 are first timers. They come from various states, so we know the obvious one because we're here. New York State? New Jersey?
Ministerpräsidenten Sarkarpanski danach.
Видно, що хлопці не лише шкіна поїли, а от хоч кашу. Окей, ми тепер кінцаємо перша частина нашої програми. Ми відміжмо коротку перерву. We'll take a short break. My watch says 4.35. Ten minutes. Ten minute break. Десять хвилин перерву. Прошу тоді на січня, що ми продовжуємо нашу програму. Дуже дякую.
and the Ruby Slippers, ladies and gentlemen, let's have a nice round of applause for the dancers ready to perform this beautiful piece.
watch AGT, you don't know its initials are AGT? <laughs> For those of you who watch America's Got Talent, this would be a golden buzzer. Yeah. Oh, golden buzzer. Okay, the reason we have to prepare for the first one, I have to pass the paper to Madeleine, and I will talk with this microphone so that you know that she is here. But I'm still alive. And I have a little secret back here. Oh, they stole it already. Oh, no, they did. They just moved it. We're gonna bring this out. Show me what we're supposed to do. Read me slowly with our president. I'm a Roman Hernando Slava. Děkuji vám, kolegové. Vaše vysoké prosvěštěnstvo vládejte a metropolitě. Se čistnější oči do podpárok kašťák. Se čistnější oči Voldemere. Dora paní Ani s vaším kolektivem, vključno s panem Orlando, paní Larisou a paní Irkou. Достойно команда медичної опіки, котра пильнувала наших таборовиків минулого тижня, минулих тижнів радше. Дорогі батьки, бабусі, дідусі та члени розширених родин наших таборовиків. Шановні друзі, котрі беруть участь у сьогоднішньому концерті через живе телебачення, Дорогі танцюристи, дорогі гості, коректорню, добрий день, слава Ісусу Христу! Each of us is painfully aware of the current situation in our beautiful Ukraine, where our enemy to the east has once again invaded our sacred soil, in the latest reminder that it is not interested or perhaps even able to engage in the behavior we expect in a world of civilized and peace-loving nations. Once again, we bear witness to an attempt to erase the Ukrainian culture and replace it with one of violence, greed, and evil. These goals, these territorial aspirations will not succeed. Ukraine will prevail. Permoha budeza namen. In the face of these challenges, however, our Ukrainian-American and Ukrainian-Canadian communities remain strong and unified. They facilitate various venues of support desperately needed by our brothers and sisters who are fighting to preserve our culture. Financial support, material support, political support, and spiritual support through our prayers to the Almighty. Just as importantly, we gather at various events throughout the year to celebrate numerous aspects of our glorious culture, just as we're doing today, when we take this opportunity to celebrate our music and our dance. But in reality, this gathering represents nothing more than just a celebration of our culture. It represents an investment in our future. It represents an understanding among you, ladies and gentlemen, mothers and fathers, grandparents, aunts and uncles, that preserving our culture in the future requires us to invest in the present. And to my mind, the most effective way to invest in our future is by way of our children. The next generation of leaders within our Ukrainian-American and Ukrainian-Canadian communities who will take the proverbial baton from us at some point and run forward with it. The foundation of that investment is built by teaching our children about our traditions and our native land, our music, our history, our dance, our language, our literature, and our religion. Over the course of modern history, no political movement, group, or individual has been successful in destroying those hallowed reflections of who we are as Ukrainians, and they never will.
At this time, not only would I like to congratulate and thank Pani Anya for continuing her investment in our future by preserving the legacy of her mother, Pani Rama, and the countless numbers of individuals who now carry that legacy, but to also congratulate you, our moms and dads, for bringing the young ladies and gentlemen who are performing today to this picturesque resort, enrolling them into the 2024 Ukrainian Dance Camp, and confirming your investment in preserving our culture, our traditions, and our future. And most importantly, thank you to our children, our dancers, our future, for the Kodak moments you're giving us today and for being our sunshine. You are truly what makes us a great and noble people. Over its 130 years of existence, the Ukrainian National Association has recognized the significant role that it must also play in that investment. Whether it's through the purchase in 1952 of Soyuzilka, which this year celebrates its 72nd year in Ukrainian hands, the annual scholarships we provide to college and post-grad students on the path to leadership, our traditional book of life insurance and annuity products, or the innumerable financial contributions and donations that we have made to our communities and our youth, we recognize and acknowledge our task. On that note, it is my privilege to announce that in cooperation with Pani Anya, I have arranged for the UNA to cover all room and board costs for all the refugee children participating in this session of Ritavia who are here from their war-torn homeland, our Ukraine. Rest assured you have my commitment, as well as those of my colleagues, that the UNA will continue in these efforts, continue to make investments in our future, and continue to advance the betterment of the lives of all of our children. Thank you for providing me with a brief moment of your attention. May the Lord God bless and preserve Ukraine, at all times protecting her from malice. Glory to Ukraine. Slava Ukraine. Pulled out a wafer and wine. Moishi 
pulled out an apple. The Pope said, because he was Italian at that time, ah, this guy's a too good. I cannot debate him. Here, the Jews can stay. That's it. It's okay. The debate's over. So now the Pope went back to his community and they said, Your Eminence, what happened? Oh, that Moishi, he was just too smart for me. Tell us what happened. I told him, three representing the Trinity. He told me, yes, the Trinity, but there's one God common to both our religions. And he had a point. So then I said, God is all around us. Moishi said, God is here with us right now, right here. Finally, I pulled out the wafer and the wine to remind them of original sin. He pulled out the apple, saying to remind me of original sin. He said, I couldn't debate him anymore. He had to let them stay. Meantime, in the Jewish community, they said, Moishi, what happened? This guy told me, three days, all the Jews have to leave. I said, not one of us is leaving. He said, the Jews, we're going to round them up and throw them all out. He says, we're all staying right here. Finally, they said, Moishi, what happened then? I don't know. He took out his lunch. I took out my lunch. One minute, two minutes, I'll only think of something else. Do you think a contemplative monk is a deep fryer? <laughs> uh, gotta, throw, gotta throw one of those in, you know, you can't just have those smooth ones. Once in a while, have a... I found a $20 bill in the grocery parking lot, and I said to myself, what would Jesus do? So I turned around in the store and turned it into wine. <laughs> Okay. Orlando, more? Still keep going. Orlando really liked the joke that I used last year. What was it? Uh, what did the Mexican uh, magician say he's going to make something disappear? He said, uno, dos, and then he disappeared without a trace. <laughs> A Mormon is seated 
next one attend, a Ukrainian on a flight from London to the U.S. After the plane was airborne, drinks were ordered. The Ukrainian asked for vodka, <laughs> go figure, which was promptly placed before him. The flight attendant then asked the Mormon if he would like a drink. He replied in disgust, I would rather be ravagedly raped by a dozen whores than let liquor touch my lips. The Ukrainian then handed his drink back to the attendant and said, Me too, I didn't know we had a choice. <laughs> He walked to the door and yelled, I hope you died a long, slow, painful death. He turned around and said, so you want me to stay? <laughs> when I hear moans, who moan? Who moan? Who wants the microphone? Who moan? Uh, uh, microphone here. Yeah, we'll give you the microphone. Okay. Who moan? Who moan? Who? Oh, the hair? Oh, the hair? Sit here, the cigar. Oh, ha, ha, ha. That's what I said. He doesn't want to say his name. Anybody want to say their name? What's your name? Sophia. Sophia, are you enjoying the show? No. <laughs> do, you, do you know what you paid for this show? Nothing. It's free. And when something's free, you gotta smile and say, that was great. Let's try this again. What's your name? Sophia. Sophia, how are you enjoying the show? Thank you. 
right now while they're all present is two thumbs up saying it's time for the whole
A special thanks to our wonderful MC, Ron. You had no idea how much extra stuff you'd be doing. Yeah, we would be. Your artistry, your inspiration, 
and your hard work and your creativity. And Miss Anna, for many music editing sessions in the heat behind Ushwara, because that's where the Wi Fi is in Ushwara at times. <laughs> and a special thanks to my wonderful husband, who supports me throughout the year. <laughs> but the prep for camp, as well as costumes, got for you. Here's a housekeeping. After the curtain closes, and you'll see it here a big hurrah, we'd like to take a group picture. Ladeko, if we could ask you to join us for the picture. I prearranged the kids, so hopefully it doesn't take long. So all the paparazzi, you can line up. We have official photographers, and we'll call them Kevich and Pan Kodiklu, Pan Andrina and they'll be taking photos. Uh, hopefully not for half an hour. And the other housekeeping is we need the costumes returned. We've had a flood upstairs, so Bear with us to try to get them. And to all the audience, thank you for your patience, not just with music, but with the deluge. It took a while to get all the kids downstairs without getting them sopping wet and without their feet wet. Marley and wet boots, very bad combination. So to all my kids, keep smiling, keep dancing, keep up the good work. I love you all, and I hope to see you again next summer.